Just a quick point of clarification, Kareem. So when Donald Trump is talking about a bloodbath, it is violent rhetoric. What was it when Joe Biden said in 2020, we, uh, what we can't let happen is let this primary become a negative bloodbath? So I'm going to be really mindful and careful about uh, Donald Trump, but if you read, uh, because he is a he is a candidate, we're talking about a 2024 election, you should read hit what he said in its context. So you got to read what he said in context. Bloodbath is an ugly word. We when got, Trump uses it, what is it? It's when not, Biden uses it. No, no, no. Let's be very clear. you got to actually ask me the question in context of what it was said, right? And what the it, what it was said when he said that, right? In his remarks, in his speech, right? And so that's being disingenuous in your question. I'm reading but, a direct quote from Joe Biden. What we can't let happen is let this primary become a negative bloodbath. He's talking about... He was talking about a group of people, a group of people. That's what he's talking about. What the president was talking about during the primary was not to allow it to be the words and, and the primary and that election to become negative. Two different, two different things. They're not the same. They're not the same. And your question is disingenuous. And so, look, I'm going to be really mindful here. I'm going to be really careful. We have to denounce violent rhetoric which wherever it comes from a former leader we have to denounce that because we saw what happened on january 6. we saw what happened there when you have a mob of 2,000 people go to the capitol because they didn't believe in free the free and fair election that just happened months prior because of violent rhetoric you got to denounce that that's not what leaders should be doing all right i think i have to go go ahead Eric.